a national icon, the Santa Monica Pier is one of the most photographed locations in the world and one of Los Angeles's most visited tourist stops. The pier has a variety of attractions with carnival games, rides, restaurants, and shops to experience. A destination where people come together and enjoy the seaside culture. Thousands of visitors walk the pier for the opportunity to take in the crashing waves, salty air, and ocean views. Whether hanging out with friends or taking a romantic walk at sunset, the Santa Monica Pier is the perfect Southern California experience. The pier welcomes more than 9 million visitors a year. It's the number one Instagram spot in California. An historic landmark, the pier has been an iconic backdrop for more than 500 Hollywood films and TV shows. The Santa Monica Pier is also the end of the famous highway Route 66, which runs across most of the United States. The original pier was built in 1909 to handle Santa Monica's wastewater. A second pier was built by Charles Luff, a renowned carousel builder who built an amusement park over the water. Over the decades, the two piers were joined and transformed into a seaside resort for the residents and tourists alike. The Pleasure Pier, as it was known, thrived during the 1920s, but was hit hard by the Great Depression of the 1930s. For years, the pier needed constant and expensive repair, becoming an aging eyesore. Little used for decades, the plans were to demolish the pier for redevelopment. Storm yesterday morning. The buildings are gone, the fishing platform is gone, just a gaping tear at the end of the pier, which now seems to hang by a thread. The debris was... Heavily damaged by storms in the 1980s, the city of Santa Monica decided to create a commercial development with amusement rides, gift shops, nightclubs, and restaurants that would invoke the pier's heyday of the 1920s and the 1930s. For over a hundred years, the Santa Monica Pier Carousel has been a popular entertainment destination for families and visitors. It is one of the few original merry-go-rounds still in operation from the golden age of seaside entertainment. The building housing the carousel is called the Luff Hippodrome, after the great ancient Greek stadiums used for horse and chariot racing. It was designed and built in 1916 by Charles Luff and his son Arthur. The original carousel was replaced by the Ocean Park Pier Carousel in 1939. Built by the Philadelphia Toboggan Company, the structure features 44 hand-carved horses, two sleighs, one pig, and one goat lit up with over 1,100 electric lights. The carousel has been a beautiful movie location and backdrop for movies and TV shows. The historical Miracle Round landmark is open a few days during the week and weekends till dusk. Starting in 1987, the pier was restored with concrete pilings and a new classic wooden deck and was completed in 1990. It looks like a wooden pier, but actually underneath it's cement. There are a wide variety of novelties, souvenirs, and merchandise in the shops and street vendors located along the pier. You can also rent bikes, boogie boards, chairs, and umbrellas to enjoy the nearby boardwalk and sandy beach. The Playland Arcade has classic games to test your skills and includes the famous Zoltar, who will read your fortune for you. Some visitors enjoy fishing from the pier, and the bait and tackle shop has everything you might need to drop a line in the water. Pacific Park, with its Ferris wheel and other amusement rides, is a relatively recent addition. 
Pacific Park opened up on the Santa Monica Pier in 1996. With full modern rides and 15 midway games, it is a safe and fun entertainment venue for residents and visitors. This is the only solar powered Ferris wheel in the country, using 650 panels to generate the amount of kilowatts needed to keep the wheel turning. Each of the 20 gondolas can carry up to six people that lifts them up 130 feet above the Pacific Ocean. Eight electric motors power the 85-foot diameter wheel. On a busy day, a full turn can take up to three minutes. The LED lights mounted on the spokes and the wheel alternate between various hues of red, blue, and green. At night, the colorful light show can be seen for miles along the coast. A true historical landmark, the Santa Monica Pier continues to draw millions of guests each year with its old school atmosphere and classic family entertainment. There is no charge to enjoy the Santa Monica Pier, so wander through the shops, rides, and games at Pacific Park Amusement, and you can enjoy the sight and sounds of crashing waves and the delights of families enjoying themselves.